moving finger writes, said the poet long ago, and it's good to know in this age of typesetting and word processing that the poem still holds true. Scribe to the Queen, Donald Jackson is a calligrapher, a painter of words. The title for the exhibition is Painting with Words. So I'm using words not only for their sound, but for their shape and for their texture and mass so that it is possible to take letters, just like notes of music, and create a symphony with them. You'll see here my copies of medieval manuscripts as an 18-year-old looking in the museum very hard at the way that people used to do things. And with my feet in those, over the course of 30 years, you see me doing looser and looser things. But not only is Mr. Jackson perhaps the finest calligraphic artist of the Western world, but he's also an appointed scribe to Her Majesty's Crown Office of the House of Lords, responsible for royal charters like this one. Charters for special occasions, like the marriage requests for Prince Charles and Prince Andrew. Call this the calligraphic equivalent of dressing up with top hat and gloves. Every piece of work in this museum, be it calligraphy or sculpture, had a hand in it. And that heartbeat of that individual is transferred into the stone, or in my case, into the surface of the written marks. Bring a magnifying glass and take a look and see if you can pick up my heartbeat in the work. The moving finger writes, said the poet, and having writ, moves on. From the Nelson Gallery with photographer Ibel Garza, I'm John Tibbetts for KCTV 5.